Welcome to a new video where we delve into the fascinating world of menstrual cycles. It's a natural process, a symphony of hormonal changes, that prepares the body for potential pregnancy. Yet, it's often met with a sense of mystery, or even dread. But knowledge is power, and understanding the signs that your period is just a day away, can help you be prepared and take better care of your body. This video is here to demystify those signs, 11 of them to be exact, that your period is coming tomorrow. So let's dive in and explore these telltale signs all backed by scientific research. Before we go any further, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. First, let's briefly discuss menstrual cycles, a natural process occurring in females. The menstrual cycle is a fascinating orchestration of hormones, occurring typically between every 21 to 35 days and lasting 2 to 7 days. This cycle is not just about having a period, it's a series of changes preparing the body for potential pregnancy. So, what exactly happens during this cycle? Well, it all begins in the brain, specifically in the hypothalamus, which sends signals to the pituitary gland. These signals trigger the release of hormones like estrogen and progesterone. These hormones then cause the lining of the uterus to thicken, ready to host a fertilized egg. If no fertilization occurs, this lining is shed, resulting in what we commonly know as a period. Understanding this cycle is key because it's the foundation for recognizing changes in your body. These changes, believe it or not, can give you a heads up that your period might be on its way. Now that we understand the basics of a menstrual cycle, let's move on to the signs indicating your period might be coming tomorrow. The first sign to look out for is abdominal cramps. Now, let's delve a little deeper into why this happens. You see, menstrual cramps are caused by your uterus contracting to shed its lining. That's right, your body is merely preparing for your period. This process is driven by hormone-like substances called prostaglandins, which are associated with pain and inflammation. Higher levels of these substances in the uterine lining may lead to more severe menstrual cramps. Now, these cramps can range from a dull and constant ache to a series of sharp piercing sensations. They are usually felt in the lower abdomen or back, and can begin a day or two before your period starts. In fact, for some, these cramps might be their first clue that their period is about to start. And while they can be quite uncomfortable, rest assured, they are a perfectly normal part of the menstrual cycle. There are ways to manage these cramps such as heat therapy, relaxation techniques, or over-the-counter pain medication. But remember, if your cramps are severe or you're concerned, it's always best to consult a healthcare professional. So, if you're experiencing abdominal cramps, it could be a sign that your period is just around the corner. Moving on to the second sign, bloating. Bloating is one of those common discomforts that many of us experience just before our period starts. But have you ever wondered why? It's all about the hormonal roller coaster that our bodies ride every month. Just before the onset of menstruation, our bodies experience fluctuations in hormones, specifically progesterone and estrogen. These hormonal changes can cause our bodies to retain more fluid and salt than usual, leading to a feeling of puffiness or bloating. It's like your body is preparing for a big event, and in a way, it is. The menstrual cycle is a complex process and bloating is just one part of the puzzle. It's your body's way of signaling that it's getting ready for menstruation. So, next time you feel a little bloated, don't be too quick to blame that extra slice of pizza. It could be your body subtly hinting that your period is just around the corner. Therefore, feeling bloated can indicate that your period is about to start. The third sign is breast tenderness. Now this is one that many might be familiar with. It's not uncommon to experience a certain level of discomfort or sensitivity in your breasts as your period approaches. But why does this happen? Well, it's all about hormones. Your body goes through a series of hormonal fluctuations throughout your menstrual cycle. Around a week or two before your period starts, the levels of hormones like estrogen and progesterone in your body start to rise. These hormones prepare your body for potential pregnancy by causing changes in your breast tissue. As these hormone levels increase, you might start to notice your breasts feeling a little different. They might become swollen or feel heavier. You might also notice them becoming particularly tender or sensitive to touch. This is completely normal, it's just your body responding to the changes in hormone levels. These symptoms usually subside once your period begins and hormone levels drop again. So, if you're noticing these changes in your breasts, it could be a sign that your period is on its way. So, breast tenderness could mean that your period is imminent. Sign number four is mood swings. Now let's delve into the science behind this. Hormones play a critical role in our body's daily functions, including our mood. Just before your period starts, your body experiences a surge in the hormones estrogen and progesterone. 
This hormonal roller coaster may lead to feelings of irritability, sadness, or anxiety. In fact, these mood swings are so common that they're often considered a hallmark sign of an impending period. It's important to remember that it's perfectly normal to feel a bit off during this time. However, if these swings start to interfere with your everyday life, it's essential to seek help from a healthcare professional. If you're experiencing mood swings, it might be a signal that your period is due. Let's swiftly move on to the remaining signs. Sign 5 is acne, a common symptom many of us are familiar with. When your period is about to begin, your body experiences an increase in the hormones progesterone and testosterone. These hormones stimulate the production of oil which can clog pores and lead to acne. So, if you notice a sudden breakout, it could be a sign that your period is on its way. Moving on to sign 6, fatigue. As your body prepares for menstruation the levels of progesterone increase, which can cause a feeling of tiredness or fatigue. This is your body's way of conserving energy for the upcoming menstrual cycle. So, if you're feeling unusually tired, even after a good night's sleep, it could be a sign that your period is about to start. Next up is food cravings, sign 7. Have you ever noticed a sudden craving for chocolate or salty snacks right before your period? This is because the fluctuating hormone levels can affect your body's insulin resistance, leading to cravings for sugary or salty foods. So, if you're reaching for the snack cupboard more often than usual, it might be a telltale sign. On to sign 8, headaches. The drop in estrogen levels just before your period can trigger migraines or headaches. If you notice a sudden onset of headaches, it could be an indication that your period is imminent. Sign 9 brings us to changes in bowel movements. The increase in progesterone levels can slow down your digestive system, leading to constipation. On the other hand, the release of prostaglandins can speed up your digestion, causing diarrhea. These changes in bowel movements can signal the arrival of your period. Spotting, our tenth sign, is a light bleeding that can occur one to two days before your period. This happens when the uterine lining begins to shed before the start of your actual period. Spotting is a pretty clear sign that your period is about to start. Finally, we arrive at sign 11, increased sensitivity to pain. Just before your period, the pain threshold of your body decreases due to the hormonal changes. This means you might feel more discomfort or pain than usual, be it from a stubbed toe or a minor cut. These signs, while not exclusive to premenstrual syndrome, can often indicate that your period is coming tomorrow. In conclusion, our bodies provide various signals to indicate an upcoming period. From the first sign of abdominal cramps to the eleventh sign of fatigue, each hint is a part of the intricate dance of hormones that orchestrate our menstrual cycle. Remember, these signs are not a cause for alarm, but rather a testament to the marvels of our bodies. Let's quickly recap the signs we discussed. Abdominal cramps, often the first harbinger of your period, result from the uterus contracting to shed its lining. Bloating is another common symptom, courtesy of hormonal fluctuations causing water retention. Breast tenderness, sign number three, is another effect of hormonal shifts, and can range from a mild discomfort to pronounced pain. Mood swings, our fourth sign, are a result of the ebb and flow of hormones like estrogen and progesterone. Signs 5 through 11, which include food cravings, acne breakouts, heightened emotions, changes in bowel movements, sleep disturbances, a decrease in coordination and fatigue, all serve as indicators of the impending menstrual cycle. Each of these signs is a piece of the puzzle, helping to paint a comprehensive picture of what's happening inside our bodies. It's important to understand that everyone experiences these signs differently. Some may have all 11 signs, while others may have only a few, or even none at all. The key is to listen to your body, understand its rhythms, and take care of your well-being accordingly. Knowledge about our own bodies is a powerful tool. The more we understand about our menstrual cycle, the better equipped we are to handle its ups and downs. So let's celebrate these signs, not as nuisances, but as reminders of our body's amazing capability to prepare for potential pregnancy each month. If you found this video useful, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to check out our calorie and protein calculator in the description to kickstart and track your fitness journey. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to lower your blood pressure naturally, watch the video on your screen next. Thank you for watching.